Hey guys, in this video, we're gonna talk about AA. Now we're currently trading at 4020 and you can see we had a huge move in here the past two weeks. We broke out of this falling channel, but more importantly, we broke above this 23.6 FIB level, which was a resistance force. And you can see it was a resistance force in the past here in July, um, late June, early July. So we broke out of the channel and we broke out of that FIB level. So that is good news on both fronts. Going forward, that resistance now turns into support and that's currently at 38. You can see that FIB level and that nine EMA are currently trading right there in that same area at that $38 mark. Um, below that level, it is going to be the this upper trend line here or this 50-day moving average, whichever one does come first. That's 50 days currently trading at $36.69. Um, so if we do not hold that level or this upper trend line of the falling channel. Obviously, we're going to get back into this channel, um, but I don't think we're going to get down there just quite yet, especially off this big move here in the past couple of weeks. Resistance-wise, what we're looking at, well, it's going to be this 41.24 here, and then above that, it's going to be that 42.22 level, and then above that, we're going to see if we can retrace all the way up here to this 100%, which is basically your mid 44s, 4440, 4450. Um, RSI in here is 58. What's interesting to me is that the stochastics here are overbought while um, your RSI is really only at 59, 58. So um, it's kind of interesting because usually you see both of them rip up that when they're, when these stochastics rip up this hard, you kind of have the RSI follow it immediately, um, but it really didn't. And this is a huge move in here. This is like a $10 move in the past two weeks in a um, $40 stock. So that's a big move in there. And RSI is just kind of, eh, just kind of hanging out here. So that's always interesting. Did have some unusual activity here on the 37 calls out in November. So we had some unusual volume as well. Um, where else are we looking at in the options chain? Well, your IV in here is really, really low. IV rank of one. You have a raw IV of 47% by next week. That's pricing in a move around $1.88. You have a expected move of $2.93 the following Friday. And then your August monthly is everybody's pricing in right around a $3.61 expected move. So IV is relatively low compared to itself um but these moves are pretty decent um so um um, play that accordingly and just keep in mind we did have some unusual volume there on those 37s out in November just to reiterate keep an eye on that 23.6 FIB level for our support and then watch this 4124 level for our immediate resistance okay guys thanks for watching make sure to check us out on our social media we have attached links to our socials in the description and we also have a trading service if you're interested there's more information in the description below